Hi everyone, I'm Hebe and welcome back. Today I'd like to do another tutorial for you guys. It is with an eyeshadow palette by Tom Ford. It is something that I bought during the Nordstrom anniversary sale way back in July. And I saw it, you know, during the sale and every time I checked, it has been sold out. Every, every, every day pretty much until one day uh, my husband and I, we were on our way, and our daughter and her fiancé, we were on our way to a wedding in Houston. And a subscriber mentioned that it's back in stock. So while I was sitting in church, before the wedding started, you know, nothing happened yet. And I know, please don't strike me down, but I saw it online. I saw it on my phone, on my Nordstrom app, and click, I bought it. It was before, you know, anyone came down the aisle, so... We were all good. It was all good. <laughs> so I want to thank you for mentioning that it was back in stock way back in July. And since then it's been sold out. So I didn't want to do a tutorial on it or show you guys because it was sold out. But then I noticed last week that it was back in stock for, I guess, for the holidays. So here it is right here. It comes in a really nice box set. It's called the Iris, yeah, I had to make sure the name, yes. Yes, it's called the Iris Bronze Eye and Lip Kit. And it comes in a really nice box. And there you go, it comes with an eyeshadow quad and two mini lipsticks. Now this kit cost $87. Now mind you, the regular uh, Tom Ford quad sells for $88, $88. So, you're getting a pretty good deal, $87 for an, a quad and two mini lipsticks and in a nice gift box right here. Let's go ahead and see this. I haven't opened this. I haven't used this at all since I got it in July. I think by then, I think when I got it, it was in August. So I haven't even opened this. So let's go ahead and open it together. I know I'm always confused on how you open up his uh, eyeshadow quads. It comes with two mini brushes, which is nice. Comes with a, two different colors, a little felt tip one. Oh, they're both, they're double sided. But there are the two mini brushes in here. I think they're a little too small for me to use, so I'll just probably use my own brushes, but that's really nice. Okay, and here are the shadows right here. I want to say that this quad is exclusive for Nordstrom. I'm not too sure, but when I uh, clicked on the quads that are by themselves, I did not see the Iris Bronze in that. So this could be just only in this grouping, this set only. Ow, that hurt. <laughs> so this is a good, warm, neutral. I believe you can do a lot of everyday looks with this. I have another quad from Tom Ford. It is the ever popular Honeymoon. A quad, let me show you this one. Has real pretty, whoops. Oh, <laughs> one of the shadows came out. Oh my gosh, what is wrong with these? Okay, yeah, I'm having bad luck with lately with some of these shadows popping out of their little pans, but it is what it is. I haven't used this as much. I mean, you can still see that the Tom, the TF is imprinted. Let me just make sure that the shadow doesn't come back out. That you can see that the TF is still imprinted on these palettes, on these shades. So yeah, maybe I might incorporate one or two shades from this look, from this palette to this look. Let me go ahead and swatch these for you. I'm gonna go with the lightest shade here. I wanna see if there are mattes or shimmers. There's one right there. I think they do have a little bit of a shimmer to it. And then let's swatch the second one here. Yeah, that one does have a little bit of a shimmer. Okay, let's go for the darker one. All right, and then now let's go for the really dark one. Okay. There you go, hope you can see that there. All right, let me go ahead and bring you closer and we will start playing. All right, I went ahead and primed my eyes with the Benefit Stay Don't Stray eyeshadow primer. And I'm gonna go in with this first shade right here. They don't have names. No, they don't have names on them. At least I don't see any, yeah, no names. So I'll just go in with the lightest shade right here and just set my primer. 
very light, very light. Now I'm going to go in with the second lightest here. I don't know if that one will show up on my skin tone, but I will use every color in this quad palette. Okay, I think this one has a shimmer to it, so probably should not have used this one in my crease. Let's do it in the other side, make it even. Yeah, this one does have a shimmer to it, so probably should not have used that in my crease. Okay, I think they all have a little bit of shimmer in this quad, but I will still use all the shades in this one and maybe a couple from the Honeymoon. Let's go ahead and keep going. <laughs> Next, I'm going to try this shade and pop that one in my crease. We'll give it a go. We'll give it a go. That one's a pretty color, actually. I like this one. Even though I think this one does have a little bit of a shimmer to it, too, but it's, it's, it's doing good. It is blending out very nicely. I probably should mention that I was using the Sigma E55 blending brush. I'm going to go in with another Sigma brush, the E45, and I'm going to go in with this darkest shade right here. And I'm going to put that in my outer V. Just kind of pack that in right there to give me some dimension and in my crease to give me that effect. Okay, I'm going to go in with this shade again to blend it out. All right, I finished blending that out, and you know, I'm not too keen of that I put uh, shimmers in my crease because you can see the texture that I have on my lids. But you know, it's makeup. If you don't like it, you can wash it off. But I'm going to keep going with it. I'm going to keep going with it. You know, you never know how it would look at the end, but let me go ahead and put some color on my lids. And I'm going to go with the Honeymoon palette. I could probably still used you know this palette right here used it all over my lid but uh let's go ahead and try this one the honeymoon palette i'm going to go in with the first shade here and pop that one in the inside corner of my eye i'm going to use my finger that's a pretty uh, champagne color very nice okay that's a pretty color Next, I'm going to go in with this burgundy purpley shade right here. I'm going to put that all over my lid or, you know, in the center of my lid. Next, I'm going to go in with this dark shade right here to go in the outer corner to kind of darken it up a little bit. I know I used that one from the Iris Bronze, but I still want to darken it up a little bit. Did I mess up this look? I hope I did not mess up this look. It is a pretty palette, but they do have some shimmers in this one right here. So it wouldn't be good, at least for me, for me, for my uh, transition shades. It's not a good transition shade for me. But the Honeymoon palette's really nice. Really nice. I don't know why I just wanted to declutter it uh, earlier this year. All right, I'm going to finish putting the rest of my makeup on, and we will see how this works out. But so far... Uh, I'm kind of iffy on it, but we'll see how the finished look looks. All right, here's the finished look. You know, it's not bad. It's not bad. I really do like it, but I'm still not too keen on having shimmers in my crease. I'm going to come up a little closer so you can see what it looks like. You can kind of see the shimmer there, and I do have the texture on my lid, so it kind of emphasizes, emphasizes it a little bit, but... Let me look down so you can see. I do have to say that the shimmers are not very chunky. It's very smoothing and it is kind of subtle, but uh, I don't know. Maybe I need to get used to having shimmers in my crease. Again, it's not that boom, you know, look at you from space type of shimmer. It's very subtle, but with my aging eyelids, my texture and crepey eyelids. I'm afraid it might emphasize that a little bit, but I do like this look. I do like using the both the uh, both quads with this look. And let me show you what I put underneath my eyes. I used these two shades right here and I placed that, you know, underneath my lash line to blend it out. And, you know, I kind of, I kind of, yes and no. I don't know. <laughs> I guess I just need to get used to it. But I do like these two palettes together. This one by itself, maybe not enough for me because I do like my metallics, my shimmers. 
yeah, I know I'm 51 years old and I probably shouldn't be using, you know, shimmers, but it's whatever you like. It's makeup and that's what I like. And yeah, you know, I'll keep, you know, I'll keep this on during the day and maybe I might do a check-in to see how it looks. But I do kind of like it. <laughs> now this kit does come with two mini lipsticks and I'm going to try one of them now. I'm going to use Casablanca because I do have a full size of this shade because I want to keep these, keep these two shades as for a giveaway. But I will show you what uh, the other one is. I believe it's called Spice Honey. Let me just show that to you. I'm not going to swatch it. I'm just going to open it up. Oh, that is a mini lipstick. <laughs> but this is Spiced Honey. Yeah, it may be too light for me, so I'm not going to even swatch it or try it. I'm going to save it for a giveaway. And also the small one of Casablanca because I do have the full size. So let me go ahead and try this one. All right, here is Casablanca, and let me show this one to you, too. Let me go and swatch it for you. It's a real pretty pinky, plummy shade. Tom Ford lipsticks, they are very creamy, they are very pigmented, they come in a, you know, a wide range of colors, and they are also very expensive. The price of one lipstick from Tom Ford costs $55. So they are very expensive. Are they worth it? You know, there are a lot of other lipsticks out there that cost much less than Tom Ford. And if, you know, if you have the funds and you like the shades that it comes in and you like the formula, then by all means. But there are other lipsticks out there that are not $55. <laughs> That's just my honest opinion here. I mean, they are nice, but $55 for one lipstick is just a little bit pricey. But for $87, you are getting a quad, a limited edition quad that is not sold by itself, and two mini lipsticks. So for $87, this is a good deal. Yes, it is still expensive, but you are getting Tom Ford quad and two lipsticks compared to if you buy just the quad by itself, it's $88, and then the two lipsticks, you know, granted these are minis, but we don't go through lipsticks that often, so this is a good size. It's a really nice kit, and I may need to let this grow on me during the day, you know, having shimmers in my crease, but it is a nice uh, quad. You know, it does have nice everyday colors in here, but they do have shimmers in them. I thought they were all mattes, but they do have shimmers. And the Honeymoon Quad, it's really nice. They are all metallics, all shimmers, a lot more shimmery than the Iris Bronze one. So these will be great for, you know, a pop of color in the lid. But you know what? I think I'll hold on to Honeymoon because I wanted to declutter it earlier in the year. But who knows what next year will bring because I did go a little crazy during the Black Friday sales. I did buy several other pilot palettes out there. But we'll see, there's always room for a Tom Ford, I guess you could say. Quick update here, it's been about eight hours since I've had the eyeshadows on. And yeah, it's looking good. I could still see the shimmers in my crease. It didn't even crease up. Um, and I know I keep going on about the shimmers in my crease, but I guess I'm just used to having mattes there. And, uh, and because of my age and the texture on my lids, you know, I don't want it to emphasize it more with the shimmers. But, I mean, so far it's it's holding on. Let me come closer so you can see. Okay, I'm going to look down. What do you think, guys? Does it look all right? Did not crease up. It did not, uh, you know, fade. And you can still see the colors on my lid. So these shadows from both uh, quads is holding up on its own. They are a little bit pricey. I mean, just a single one by itself. I think, yeah, this is the Honeymoon one. Uh, cost $88 and you get the kit, you know, the, the special edition one, the Iris Bronze and the two minis for 87. So that one is a better deal if you're interested in the Tom Ford and, and the minis, but yeah. I will continue to use these, even though I'm not used to having shimmers in my crease. I know I keep saying that. 
but I will continue to use these and we will go from there. All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching. I'm gonna go wash off this makeup now and I've been enjoying that LMS cleansing balm. Oh my gosh, that thing is nice. <laughs> but anyway, that's for another video. This is for the Tom Ford. But yes, thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.